a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the neighborhood. We keep mine. <laughs> Big hey everybody, it's David and Jen here and we are excited to be back with you on this Saturday. We have a tutorial or, I don't know, is it a tutorial or is it just you doing what you're going to be doing? I got confused, you were saying Saturday because that's when the video comes out, but today is not Saturday. So I was confused. For Cut! We're coming to you today on this hopefully beautiful Saturday wherever you're located and David's going to show you an exciting way, or I think it sounds exciting, way to make a floral butterfly. Can you tell us a little bit more about this creation? Uh, just a little bit because it's just like a starting idea. So oh, that's, okay. that's usually what happens is I just build as I go and I just thought, you know, it'd be cool if I built a butterfly out of flowers, like, but not like a little butterfly. Like, Big one. Big one. And this is for the Atlanta showroom? Yeah, so I have to do things to our showroom. I have to tear apart our spring section and redo that so that we get people excited about spring 2024. And I thought, hmm, maybe we're going to do a butterfly garden. I think that garden. Yeah, I thought you said garland, but that would be pretty too. Um, butterfly garland. I think that would be really cool to have butterflies in different sizes and everything uh, in our showroom. Okay, well I can't wait to see the end result. Stick around. We hope you like it and that you enjoy the show. Regular two by twelve by thirty-six sheets of styrofoam to make our butterfly. I cut it a little bit of an angle so it wouldn't be completely straight. It's got a little bit of give in the wings, so that it's not just flat. And I basically just added pieces on where I needed. You can see the seams, but we're going to cover this up. I'm going to cover the bottom with boxwood mats and we're going to cover the top with flowers. So now I have my Butterfly shape covered in boxwood mat, loose piece, and we are ready to start on the other side and get some flowers going in a pattern.
So this is our finished butterfly. You can see I added a couple of antenna at the top and he's got a nice pattern running through him. We'll probably do a couple of different more styles and patterns for our showroom, but this is the first one from my crazy idea to make giant butterflies. We'll probably hang this guy in the window kind of at this angle with a giant flower under him, make him look like he's gathering nectar, maybe give him some legs at some point. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, you know, comment, subscribe, do all those things that people do that watch videos. And um, we look forward to seeing you soon.